Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, I'm Sebastian, a first year medical student studying at Sydney University. And I'm off to uni today, so I'm gonna make the trek over there. It's about an hour and I need to take a few buses and trains. So I'll see you when I get there. This looks absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> Hey guys, I just arrived to uni. Um, a few buses and a few trains later, I got here behind this Victoria Park. So I'm just gonna have a walk through and I'll get to my class. I've got some lectures on rural health and some other things. I'll see you in a bit. I've just arrived in the lecture and as this is a Thursday, it's a bit of a longer day for us because we have both lectures and practicals, lectures in the morning from 9 to 12 and practicals in the afternoon. Usually we only have lectures and seminars on the day or we have our hospital day where we do bedside teaching and go see patients. But today I actually skipped the first lecture because I was filming some of the stuff that you saw at the start of the video. So I've made the second lecture at 10 a.m. which is on the clinical examination and investigations of hypertension. We're in our fifth block, cardiovascular block and each week is divided into different pathologies or different problems. So this week's focus is on hypertension and the pharmacological management and complications surrounding that. So when I'm in the lecture, I like to write notes on my iPad, annotate the lecture slides, and sometimes Google things on my um, laptop if I need to. Okay, hold on, sorry, oh, hi. So we just finished our prac. I'm here with my friend Paris. Hey. And we're trying to meet our mate Elijah, who's not coming out of his dorm. So we're gonna like shout yep. at his window and hopefully he'll come out. I think it's this one, but we'll see how it goes. Elijah! Elijah, mate! Elijah. Check out the window! <laughs> Wear your pants and get out! Nope. No response. No response. <laughs> Hello, Hello, Hey, mate. Hey, girl. <laughs> Give me a hug. Give me a hug. Elijah lives in a really um, ghetto part of the up Sydney. That's not true. No, he's, this My is a pretty, is this, this is a pretty nice place. Not gonna lie. It is. Yeah, it's it pretty is. good. It's Paul likes it. They're my cat ears. So pretty. I love it. Look, aren't they cute? They are so cute. They're adorable. I love it. Hey guys, so I'm off to my pathology practical. We have one of these a week. Um, they go for about an hour and a half and my class has already started, so I'm a bit late. So I'm just making my way over there now. And yeah, it should be fun. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Thank you. So we just finished our pathology prac. We had um, a histology revision session for the upcoming exam. And we're looking at a bunch of specimens and doing a practice exam. What you, how'd you find it? Good? Yeah, it was Easy. good. It was good. I, I, I did well in yeah. the formative practice. Yeah, I got about 50%, so a lot to improve on, but we got like two weeks into the exam. Um, we're just grabbing food now. We're at 
Alice, Alice Thai. King Street Newtown. King Street Newtown, which is pretty good. Yeah, so we're just gonna grab some takeaway and then go back to uni. Elijah, fun fact. Uh, I'm eating, can you like? <laughs> so I haven't properly introduced these guys. This is Elijah and this is Paris. Sup? <laughs> and we're all Prac group members. That's why we know each other. We met eight months ago. I yeah. think so. At the start of the year. Nine months ago. Yeah, Let's I'm just say end of January. Yeah, I'm sort of the one that gets teased in the group. That's that's what they it like me for. Weird. Just set it up, walked and oh, ran You're still back walking. To grab it. There's a difference between actually walking and then it's saying so disgusting weird. lies like you're gonna study. <laughs> <laughs> How should I stop? We should talk about where we are. Hanging outside, man. So we just finished lunch and we're hanging outside Manning Building, which is like, what do you reckon? It's like so the food courty. There's a bar yeah. at the top, they have a lot of events and stuff, so sure. it's a pretty nice spot. I'm here with my mate Kenneth. This is Kenneth. Hi. He's, um, he's one that recommended us to go to the Thai place, which is pretty good. We just finished eating. Um, he's a foodie. so Yeah, just go to Cabra, mate. Cabra matter. That's all you need. We're just waiting for our next prac. We got anatomy um, coming up, and it's sort of a revision prac for our assessment that's where we have to do like a spot test and identify different sort of um, identifications on a pro section. So it's just a good way to revise and we've got that in about 20 minutes. So we're just in Anderson Stewart, it's like the med building and we've got our anatomy prac now, so we get into it. guys, so we just finished our anatomy practical. Um, the prac buddies, they kind of left. I'm just outside the anatomy building, so we have our anatomy classes in that building just there, where the jacaranda tree is. Um, super nice, it's called the Anderson Stewart Building, and it's basically the anatomy hub of most of the university. It has three or four little dissection rooms and um, prosection rooms, and they also have a cool little museum where you can go in your spare time and have a look at certain prosections. So we usually do these anatomy shoots um, once per week. They go for two hours and it's really good. It helps put like all the theory that we're learning in lectures into a prac environment where we have to like look and make identifications. So today was just mainly revision of uh, head and neck anatomy and thorax sort of heart region anatomy. So it was a lot of fun. Um, got the exam coming up soon. So I've got to do a lot of prepar preparation for that. Yeah, and before I forget, so I've got a practice exam for the rest of the night. It's an exam run by the Medical Student Association. So they provide a little mini exam, practice exam, before we do the real thing, which is a good thing, two weeks beforehand. So I'm about to check it out and find my mate. I'll see you in a bit. Hey guys, so um, we just got to the venue, it's at Wallace Theatre, where we're going to do the um, sort of practice assessment. This is my good mate Declan. Hi guys. I've known Declan for like, what, five years? Yeah, almost that, yeah. Yeah, pretty much all of my undergrad, so yeah. good guy, smart guy, and we're going to try pump out uh, the exam and hopefully not get too hammered. So we'll see how it goes. <laughs> See you, mate. See you, bro. Take it easy. Catch ya. Thanks, guys. Yeah.
Hey guys again, so it's pretty damn late. I just got back home. I don't know if you can see this But it's running near 11 o'clock We finished the prac exam at about 9 p.m. But by the time that you chat with mates and go over answers and do all that jazz it gets pretty late and obviously making the the commute back home was a bit of time as well, but um, I've unpacked. I'm about to knock off and have a shower. But hopefully this gave you a good insight on what an average day is like for me. As you can see, it's not all doom and gloom. Yes, med students, we have a lot of study and we have a lot of assessments and a lot of things to learn. But we can also have a lot of fun and it's all about, you know, breaking up all the study with lunches, fun times with your mates. And it's all about doing it with, with some people that you know to make the journey a little bit more interesting, a little bit more enjoyable. So on that mark, I'd like to give a special shout out to my prac buddies, Kenneth, Elijah and Paris. They're a good group of mates that I met this year. It makes my sort of university experience a lot more fun and it was a lot of fun to film with them. And special shout out to my boy Declan for being such a good mate over these last um, five years, but also for being filmed in the video and being my designated driver for tonight. I'm, I'm glad that you made it to the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it and found something useful, something entertaining. If you liked it, chuck us a like. If you want to see more content like this, subscribe and ring the bell and stay tuned for more stuff like this. So until next time, my name was Sebastian. Stay sharp.